The all is mind. The universe is mental. I think we need to think of reality as something solid because that's more comfortable. To me, it, it's part of the illusion. The thing with alchemy is the idea that its basic theory of creation is the same throughout the universe. The same kind of way the universe was created is the same way any small individual act of creation occurs as well. As a medium, in my very early developing days, I didn't have guides or teachers in the human form to help me. I would find myself sort of talking to lights and energies. I had a friend years ago, and she passed away in 1994. And then just a few months back, I was in Spain, and I looked into the eyes of my dead friend. She said, there is not a clear line between life and death. It's a matter of discontinuous boundaries. You know, if we look at the sequence of one's past lifetime impacting itself over and over again in a kind of feedback loop, the rhythm of things is, is constant. I think the cause and effect idea is very linked to that linear uh, way we perceive the world, that everything is um, literally a wheel. We have agency on the direction that, where that wheel goes and the speed it goes to. I think that everybody is functioning magically and everybody's functioning on some level of using what is magic or what is metaphysical. Why does reality come into being the way that it does? The Kabbalion is a work that brings ancient psychology back to us today. And if you can work with and come to understand its principles, you'll come to rediscover yourself as you really are, infinite. <laughs>